Okay, so we're going to be playing some more Rayman 3. And do I even have my... So I, I, have, I have come prepared tonight, guys. Today with me, I have uh, my Game Boy right here. So if we manage to beat the game, we are able to connect it to... Oh, listen to this. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So I have my Rayman 3 right here. So if we're able to complete Rayman 3 tonight, we will get to see that. There we go. Now, 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 what was the volume we had last time? I think it was this. So do, do tell me if the game was too loud. It's always a hassle with these capture devices. Nostalgia sound. Panties! So yeah, uh, oh, as much as I'd like to listen to that, I have to skip it this time. Last time, <laughs> it did end up getting claimed, so I had to mute it on YouTube. But hey, it was uh, fun while it lasted. Ooh! I wouldn't have muted it otherwise, but it also got blocked in some countries, so I had to, you know. Damn it, YouTube! All right, let's go in. Get in, get in, get in. We're gonna worry about the bonus after the main game. What is BCB? BCB is the save file name I've used ever since I was a small child. For the very first time when, when I played Rayman 1 for the first time ever, my save file was called BCB. Doesn't mean anything, it's just something I always used. And it uh, has almost become a kind of tradition. <sighs> Yo, someone should put all the Rayman groaning and moaning sounds <laughs> right after each other so we can have like Rayman masturbating sound, <laughs> sound audio. <laughs> Okay. No. Is this where the big guy comes? Oh, bro, dodged. Oh, the tower. Yeah, that's uh I always liked this tower area. Did you know that you can skip this section by stopping the hoodlum to close the, from closing the gate? I did not know that. That's cool. Let's get some of these jewels before we go in. Hey, man, sex tape. Oh dear, I fell down. We are going to need uh, the pot, the green pot, for this. The tower still looks amazing to this day. It's really cool, I wish they had some lore. You hate the rain effect? What's, uh, what's up with the rain effect? Also, where was this hoodlum? I heard like... Oh, there it is. I see it now. No potion, though. Yep. If you remember correctly, these teensies were sealed away in this tower because they partied too hard, but they were fine with it. The lore is that the ghosts live here. Where Where is this lore from? This is the first time I'm hearing this. Probably from the manual. Oh, Lobox, stay in your pants. Stay in your gut, should I say. The rain effect on the camera not only is exclusive to the GameCube version, but it's also a reused effect from Rayman M. I don't feel too good. Oh, I see what you mean now. Like the rain droplets on the camera itself. Oh yeah, that's cool. Boom. 
Oh, this music is so calm. <laughs> the game where you find all the lore from the manual. Like Murphy said, the manual, it's all in here. To go. I have an appointment with my psychic. Whoa! The broken combos. <laughs> Oh, this place is pretty. Judging by music, this is still the same level. This is still the same level. Land of the Living Dead. Yep. You're surprised more games haven't attempted what this game does with the music. I'll meet you down what does this the game do with the music? One of my brothers is still held captive. Free him, and we'll open up our world for you. Our yeah, world for you. Thank you. <laughs> How can you put in jail ghosts? Don't they go through the walls? Maybe they can't go through um, ghost walls. Plum music! <laughs> Every stage feels like a grand symphony with the same uh, melody. Oh yeah, I see. If the plum falls into water, it shrinks into non-existence. <laughs> it's funny how this game doesn't have water mechanics. Like Rayman 2 had swimming and all that shit. But this game tries to stay clear of that. This is swimming too, but it sucks. It's not really swimming though, it's just like an on-rail shooter, you can't even change your elevation. And it's only one level, that's why I said it's like, you know, way different than in Rayman 2. Where in Rayman 2 it was like a natural, natural gameplay extension thingy. Here it's just like a gimmick. Which is weird, would have been cool to see uh, swimming in this game. You hate the swimming levels in every single platformer? Wow. Oh, jewels, hang on. I forgot. Oh. Good. Yeah, it's like fake. I know exactly what you mean. Fake swimming. Oh, I remember. Yeah, we're in their world now, guys. Oh, this guy. There we go. Isn't this where we raise, <laughs> raise our toes again, if I remember correctly? We'll see. You hope Rayman 4 has swimming mechanics? <laughs> Rayman 4 is never, uh, never gonna happen. Oh yeah, this is the shoe place. Oh, it's play- Oh, this is- This is the music- Oh my god! Oh my god! I prefer this version of the music over the credits theme. 
This is the hood uh, sorcerer theme. Punch him! Punch that guy! The big sock! You know why... Okay, I'm, I'm sorry for being disgusting, but it has to be said. Do you know why the Hood Sorcerer has magical powers? Because it was made out of a used cum sock. Let us rejoice, those were Bobby's going independent. You hope we get to see some awesome original games from them in the future. <laughs> oh fuck! Bro was hiding. Come is magic question mark? Hoodlum Yumpskare. Ho scary Hoodlum Humpskare. Oh shit! Gotta watch out, don't wanna vibrate my ass with the controller again. Ooh, Donkey Kong! <laughs> Freaking Joker laugh. Oh shit! The music! There we go. Too bad it's over so soon. Oh, love the hoodoo sorcerer. Oh, there we go! Pals! Freed. The Uru is still your ringtone and you ain't changing it. Hell yeah. Dongli no gang. Cringy Kid You from uh, 2016 adapted the Uru theme as your YouTube theme. <laughs> Let me take a quick sip. You still find it funny how Psychonauts 2 ripped off the hoodoo mechanic wholesale? <laughs> oh, that's nice. I really should uh, play those games already. Here we go. Oh, we don't get the music this time. Ouch. Ow. Let's just <laughs> drive down there. Grandpa, don't go slow. I'm a grandpa, I must drive slow. Now, where's that shoe? Where's my dirty foot? Where are you hiding? Time to shrink and then enter my food and raise my other food. My favorite pastime. The devs really were just like, his shoes look like bumper cars. There's that one piece of Rayman 4 concept art where uh, 
each body or each body piece of Raymans is like a different vehicle. Like the head is a submarine, the feet are cars, the hands are who knows what helicopters, whatever. That picture always reminded me of this old McDonald's Happy Meal toy, toy where you like get pieces of Mickey Mouse and you build your own Mickey Mouse. And like the the hand was like a water gun, the head was a camera, the body, I mean the pants were a binoculars. That's what it always reminded me of. No, -uh. You finally finished eating your wings? Oh my god, bro, self-cannibalism. Bro got tired of his wings and was like, let me rip these out and just eat them. Shoe races are the only reason why you haven't attempted the max score run. <laughs> they are pretty... pretty scringies. They had the idea of the shoe since Rayman 2, apparently. The shoe race. The eternal idea. So like, vault. Oh, here we go, big boy! This guy... This guy is uh, freaky. Freaked me out as a kid. It's the scream and like the weird jump motion. Bro is screaming. It's a very cool, like, heavy, heavy hoodlum idea, but boy is he freaky. Absolute unit. You remember watching someone emulate this and the shoe was so fast and glitchy. He raged so hard. What the hell? Seventy-eight percent. We still have the desert of the Naran. We have the snow mountain. We have the Hoodlum headquarters. We have the Tower of Leptus. Yeah, there's no way I'm finishing this game tonight. Globox, stop eating your balls! Here comes the scariest enemy in the game. I love this visual, by the way, of it in the distance and just like walking down. This is the same thing that I enjoy in Raymond Raving Rabbits, where you see the giant fucking rabbit mecha in the distance. Inflation blocks. It's awesome in like a scary way. Uh, no, scary in an awesome way. Right, please, what? Oh, is this where we enter the pussy? Oh no, it comes later, I think. Okay, how do I go down? Here we go. This music is cool. It's like how the Reaper in Subnautica freaks you so much because it has spider-like face. Oh yeah, arachnophobia moment. This music. Oh, this boss. Let's see if I remember how to do this. I like that the cannon is like a hoodlum. It has like a head and everything. It's it was always like a cool detail to me. Oh, 
Oh, it's the it's the little fish that's shooting the rockets. I just noticed. Oh, Raymond really just went over. <laughs> I got it. There we go. For some reason, I re remember that this boss was uh, harder. But it's actually like piss easy. Pissing balls easy. There we go. You like this fight, but uh, yeah, the lack of swimming in overall game was disappointing. Yeah. Would have been cool to get like a proper swimming like in Rayman 2. The higher FPS on the 360 makes the laser so hard to avoid. Is it like moving faster or something? Oh my god, here it is, guys. Pussy! Raven, you're the coolest ever, and you're my bestest friend. And you're my bestest friend! I didn't know it was possible to be so lame. Ah! 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 So... The freaking opera house or whatever all this time was just a place where the teensy doctor lives. I always uh, forget that. Oh, never mind. Oh, maybe. Yes, it is, actually. This is just a room. What are they doing down there? Yeah, 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 yeah. The HD one is harder than the PS and GameCube one. Because the speed is faster. Why would they not, like, tone it down? They're being bros down there. <laughs> Playing Uno. There's a secret room in here. Let's see if I uh, remember where it is. Oh. Yo, thanks for the sub! 31 months, that's in Sanos. Mm, oh. Hang on, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I have two ideas. There we go. Did I hit the wall or did I hit the secret? I heard like a sound effect, but I'm... Okay, there is a switch. Okay. <gasps> oh my god! 
Now let's get this double combo. Hell yeah. Oh, delicious jewel candy. I don't know how you feel about Switch simulation, but that game just got a fan translation. It's one of the best new platformers. Mameda no Bakeru. I have not heard of that one. The weed doctor. Well, must have been a late night. <laughs> just kidding. Made by Goodfeel. I don't know who they are. So the, it's familiar. The name is familiar. I'm gonna take this uh, opportunity to stretch a bit. Major bomber. You see, black lums were it produced in some kind of crazy weed. <laughs> They're really wacky. Oh, Kirby's Epic Yarn, Yoshi's Woody World. Yes. Hook you up with Kirby's Epic Barn. It smells like trousers. That sound. Hold on a sec here. Stop slapping him. Where do you get the feeling that the doctor is high? Because that's the joke. In the Polish version, he's actually stoned. No, nothing can be done. The black lum is like totally lodged. His cutscenes look like YouTube poop. I can't find it, but I know a guy who can help you. He's like a specialist in like hollow cavities, and he lives in the desert of the Canarin. Well, gotta go. Need to go water my plants. <laughs> In the Italian version, he sounds sleepy. Can someone do send this mixing of these cutscenes? Oh no, here we go again! Don't worry guys, I've gamered up. I won't fall a single time. He <laughs> visited the Willy Wonka experience. <laughs> Who is that? <coughs> it's the unknown. Are we now leaving the land of the living dead? Yes. That's the end of land of the living dead. And now we're entering the desert of the Knarren. Oh, what the hell? Did you see that? I like slid from one rail to the other. Also, I forgot to say hello people. Thank you for the raid. I know it happened a while ago already, but I forgot. Raymond one. Wah! Do I missed? <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I was too focused on not falling off. As I currently am doing. You missed the secret that you talked to the iceberg. <laughs> oh, there's the part. I want to go into the eye. Oh. I was expecting the music to get better after that. You know, that part. Oh, oh my god. Oh. 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 Oh, oh Michi. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, this the part. Whoa, whoa, camera, please. Is it just the final uh, Kinsey Highway we got, uh, anyway? And after this, we just get the shortcut stages. <laughs> oh, how I hate those shortcuts. No, I don't actually. They're uh, fine, pure platforming segments. But that's all they are. Whoa. Oh, I fell. There should be a fail counter every time you fall. No, no, no. That counter would be way too high. Still better stage than Summit Beyond the Clouds. The snow stage? Or am I uh, confusing the names? I like the snow stage a lot. Mystery surprise platforms. Yes. Oh shit. Actually, land on the platform. I ain't no fucking way. All the way over here? Nah, bro. <laughs> bro. That was the exit rail. That would have been the end. Ooh, the camera. There we go. Hell yeah. Oh. <laughs> the more you hear me speak, the more you feel he's uh, one third. Oh, here we go again. Oh my god. <laughs> As a kid, I thought this was lava and not red hot sand. Now the game turns into a horror game. Great! So this is the bone where you can activate the freaking speedrunning thing, and you can like enter the metaverse. But I don't know how to do it, it's like... Uh, it's something like this, and then you like start flying. <laughs> but I don't know anything about the speedrun strats. Let's go into the mouth. You played Drill Dozer on an emulator and your 360 controller doesn't like the rumble in that, so it just constantly vibrates. <laughs> can you get hit a few times by one of the Knarrens? There's an easter egg if you do. I can try! 
Oh, do you mean that little grasshopper never stuck your uh, fingers up your old asshole thing? And the bro with the jiggliest fucking jiggle things you know you've ever seen. This poop, green slime. This is the slime that's like super fast on the HD version. Or is it the lava? I don't remember. Regardless. I don't think this is lava. I think it's just like acid. Mountain Dew, that's what it is. Hang on. Oh wait, never mind. I'm I'm stupid. Monster energy. Monster energy. The rats are coming up. Excuse me. Is that a new way to say like I'm gonna hurl? The rats are coming up. Hell yeah, now I'm down here. <laughs> oh, the rats! The ones that like being hit. Okay, remind me where the rats are here so I'm gonna like punch them. Wrong way? Bro, what are you screaming at? This is the right way! <laughs> It isn't? Yes, it is! If you were a kid, you'd shit your pants playing this stage. There we go. Wrong way! Do it again! This level draw you crazy on the HD version because it glitched and the hook... The hook reticle disappeared. Oh, wow. Oh, I ate some McDonald's before I started streaming and now I feel huge. I'm like, oh. This area isn't the same without the cursed Ramani Narens, Knaren, sorry, with K. I wish you, we could also change the sounds. You can't eat Macadies anymore, your body rejects it. I eat it every now and then, and I have noticed that I get immense, like, pain. Stomach pain after I eat it. But... It's still bearable enough for me to eat it every now and then. <laughs> That's because it pumped full of poop. I love poop! Just foods are drugs. Fast food is stinky food. I agree. All right, here we go. Barely see. You managed to mod yourself into Rain World today. Oh hell yeah! How did you do that? 
I thought the sprite is like, or actually, never mind. You don't want to support evil and disgusting criminals. Yes. See, my, my double standards in action. Remember how I talked about Poppy Playtime last time and here I'm like, Yeah, I ate McDonald's. <laughs> Classic Rye double standards. <laughs> Playing a Ubisoft game. Classic. <laughs> With Canarin, and those beasts are in this cutscene is amazing oh, yeah. because well, you, got a better idea? you bet your bet I'm dollar I do okay listen closely big nose do not let the Canarin get near you you understand never if they get their claws on you you're dead well it was a nice knowing ya the freaking delivery in this cutscene is like the most broken one ever you should add a Raimani nerd emote I actually have a potential candidate for that, but I haven't gotten around to adding it yet. Not made by me, someone else made it. <sighs> this shit was so scary as, uh, as a kid. Like the echo screams. And this part, like, you gotta start running. <laughs> Making right bad checks. Just imagine how scary they would have been if Rayman 3 was more serious. Hello people, welcome. You arrived at the perfect time. We have just entered the desert of the Knaren. Where's the Romani skin? <laughs> Oh my god, this is the Gnosis uh, audio. Wow, wow. Crush his bones. Crush his cock. Oh wait, never mind. We are supposed to use use this. Wasn't there something else I gotta shoot with this too? Like this? No. The yellow bong. <laughs> yeah, the yellow bong. Where is it again? I'll find it. I'll find it. Remember secret coming soon. I will. I will try. Oh. Spit in his eye. Spit in his eye. Oh, the guy is back. Oh, jeez. You wish they didn't cut the Knarras making dick jokes? Yeah, that's what we need. That's what we needed. That's what we fucking needed in this game. <laughs> no. I, I'm joking. It would have been funny. Instead, they said dad. It, it's still kind of a dick joke. It still kind of is a dick joke. Oh, this guy's ooh, still up there. Okay. You should turn around once you hit the gongos. Like like here. Oh, you're right. Not this time, you fuck. Never mind. Bro was ready for me. <laughs> Bro was ready for me. Oh. 
the gong. That's what I'm doing! Almost had a grasshopper moment. I will do everything in my power to avoid grasshopper moments. Little grasshopper, well, fuck. You must never let the Canarins get near you. Capish? Look at that nose! <laughs> Fucking penis nose. Escape. Ouch. Right, <laughs> he's a grasshopper. I'm grasshopper pilled. Oh! I love the ghost music so much. It's one of my favorite tracks in the entire game. <laughs> the grasshopper scene used to scare the shit out of you as a kid with how... how abrupt everything stopped. That's true, it's, it's stuff like that. That gets you as a kid. Someone moaning in the music. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, wait. Never mind. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh! Okay, we can go here. I didn't see that. This is so dark, I can't see shit! What is this? You hate this ambience track so much. It's so cool. It has very good, like, scoopy music. Did you try the funny PS1 sheet yet? I think it's only in the PS2 version, so no. <laughs> Yo, why the music do that? Grasshopper Rayman 2. Grasshopper, oh fuck. Grasshopper or Rayman 2 anti piracy screen. Rayman 2 anti piracy is scarier because, you know, it's a jump scare. Bro forgot the secret hole. What the fuck? Is he I'm gonna fucking fuck you in the secret hole. Okay, where is it? Ah, uh, yeah, it's it's this. Oh! There we go. No, Rayman, put it down, put it down! <laughs> I got the secret. Collecting the green gem first. I gotta get the, the, the Duma. I gotta get the Moolah. I do like how they brought back the chicken zombies. You know all the secrets? Fuck. 65? That's so close to 69 though! Why was he so fast? Rayman, Rayman, over here! Get me up! I, 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 I. Reveal thy secrets. You're supposed to get the gem after activating the combo, so it adds double. Oh. Wait, are these the rats I can. Okay, I need to I need to evade this Naran. <laughs> Instant chat lied. <laughs> nah, I'm sure it was just the wrong rat.
Look, it's this one. What did I tell ya? It's this one. Stinky rats. No. Make him write bad checks. Yo, what the hell, bro? What's jumping? I've never seen that before. You hear this chicken zombie track and you feel like in your head, no, this is behind me, isn't he? <laughs> The track has been no classified. Sex funny. <laughs> now. Isn't this a texture from Raymond? No, no, it, never mind. I got confused. Ow. Ow. Secret platform. I know! I saw it! But I'm gonna do this first! He ba 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 ba! Yeah, the lefty statue is really cool. I agree. Oh! Oh! Never mind. I genuinely thought the green can would be here. <laughs> I didn't remember! That's the end. Welp. 7% score! Nice. Hey, have any cost, sir? Sure. Coaster? Oof. Looks like those teensies will become Gnarren food. I can't see shit. This is so dark. <clears throat> oh, cough syrup. Ah. Bro doesn't even say syrup. Will you forget two teensies? Yep. This game does not have anything like Rayman 1 where you actually have to get the teensies, so I'm not gonna like stress about it if I miss them. <laughs> you hate that I made you aware of the horny rat's existence. Wasn't even me, chat told me about it last time. The sex rat. Oh, nice score. <laughs> you desire to read some of the old Sonic Archie comics, and man, does it get weird! Oh no, not Archie comics! Two hundred and fifty. Two hundred and fifty. Look under the statue. Hang on, let me get just get off this thing. Oh, 
Not a Buddha. That looks like the silhouette of a man in the distance, kind of like the Terminator. The only thing you know from Archie is the one shadow expression that gets memed about a lot. Ooh, oh. oh, this is actually safe. Aside from a few ghosts here and there. No panty texture in GameCube? Wait, you're telling me the Knarren statue is supposed to have panties? Wait, hang on. Is this mandatory? I fell. Yep! Wow. Maybe it was censored in the Nintendo GameCube version. Or then I just blinded. Let me take another look later. Try looking at it again, but very closely. Oh yes. Maybe it's under it. Too dark to see shit! Maybe that... Though I, I can't say for sure, it's too dark. We can check in Raymap. <laughs> yeah, once again, first Raymas butt crack, then the Knorr and panties. What's next? Well, did you guys know that the snow teens he has an actual butt crack? <laughs> like I'm not even kidding. The snow teens in the model the textures it has an actual butt crack. Does everyone have a butt cracking Raymond tree? Where's this? Ah, there we go. Did you know that the first boss is named Master Cog? What? No fucking way. Did you know that Rayman's friend is called Globox? What? <laughs> right, so mean! <laughs> I'm sorry, but if there's a Captain Obvious in chat, I gotta respond with the same attitude. <laughs> Here we go. Just imagine they see it say dick. I didn't even know you can fall down here. No way. My dad's stronger than your dad. 
Read above, it will interest you more. Hmm? Zomboros! Hang on. Chat, please allow me to scroll. I can't scroll up. Oh, there we go. Speaking of butt cracks, do you know about that Rayman gnome in the corner of the initial area or the fairy council that shows his ass and has toilet paper near him? Yes, I know about the mooning gnome. Stop talking about your cocks! Did you know? Rayman has no lives. They do the dick joke in the Italian and German versions. Do they actually say the word dick? Oh, they're talking about their long hoodies. I see. Nah. <laughs> that scared me, holy fuck. Hopper moment. Little ass hopper. Never let a knarre touch your dick. Oh. Oh, look at those jewels. When you get to the hoodlum again, we can do the pause select thing you told me last time. What, what's the- Oh, you mean the info lore thing. There's nothing cooler than getting hugged by a Knarren you like. There's this one Knarren I- oh, ah! There's this one Knarren. I wish he would hug me. Gong party. How does the rumble in the GameCube controller feel anyway? You've only had a serious controller in your hands. What the hell? Why is the platform doing that? Like when I walk on the edge, it like. The floor makes sound. It's like frame one of the animation. I heard. Best boss incoming. I am inclined to agree. Reflux boss one is It's like a perfect boss It's a circular arena the boss is mostly in the middle 
There's actual attacks to dodge. You use actual attacks. Can I break this in advance? It's too blurry to see the right road. So I gotta... Yeah. I gotta throw it out. Or PC, I'm able to, like, see the correct route. But this is too blurry and dark. No. There we go. Looks like I remembered the path after all. Real gamers know the road by memory. Yeah, well I guess I'm a real gamer. Oh. Oh, James at the bottom. Oh. Well. <laughs> Can't go back now. Oh, this is the Knarr and Sewer system right here. This is where all their shit is gathered. Do they poop acid? <laughs> I think it's just uh, like a rule of nature that everything is... Uh, every sewer water is always green, you know? Right, a combo? <laughs> you ruined it? I was too busy talking about sewer poop! <laughs> <They ruined. laughs> oh. Bro, how do I get on that? I wanna get on! <laughs> this stream is not OCD friendly. <laughs> Is this how it ends? Is this because I didn't collect the gems? Is this karma? Just get up. <laughs> I'm trying! I'm really trying! I'm even touching the wall! I can't climb it! Oh, there we go. Holy fuck. Toughest jump in the game. Go down. You could have always hovered to the monkey bars. If you mean the climbable wall. I even tried hovering. Shit wouldn't work. I wasn't high enough. Reflux! Reflux! Re Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. Reflux is coming. I'm sorry, but that's a skill issue. I, 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 I agree. There's no doubt about it. Best boss coming. What do we take into account Rayman 2 bosses also? I think Reflux is the best Rayman boss. Like in Rayman 2 and 3. Oh my god, the floor! It's farting again! Tastier. Let's see how you 
No case. You remember hating it before your first Rayman 2 completion because of how unfair it seemed. Oh, Grolgoth. I like only the first half of Grolgoth. The second half I do not. Hot take, Rayman 3 has the best bosses. I don't think that's a hot take. Compared to Rayman 2, that barely even has bosses, this definitely has the best bosses. Do you know, like the seductive pose of reflux? <laughs> I'm gonna drink. Oh, it's Muggsy! Muggsy from Batman? <laughs> yeah. Let's fucking go! This reminds me of the... The beginning of uh, Jack Tree. Oh yeah, the fireballs on the sides. Oh yeah, you gotta... Okay, now I remember, now I remember. You gotta wait and then whack the staff. And, and get hit... Constantly. Oh! I'm missing every shot. Nice. Okay, there we go. <laughs> That's a bit better. <laughs> I'm gonna need this HP. Oh, they circle back to you. HP time. Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Yo, why did it get like super bright for a moment there if I go backwards? Oh! If it wasn't for Spore, you never would have known that uh, what a didgeridoo is. <laughs> Hell yeah! Educational game Spore. I like how you can go to the sides. It's it's a really cool uh, thing. Oh fuck!
Your least favorite Raymond Tree boss is the Swamp Witch. I think my... Hmm, uh, I don't remember. <laughs> oh, uh, I think it's the octopus. The fucking underwater robo octopus. What's the lightning from the sky? Is he getting powered by Leptus? Well, he has the Leptus staff or something, doesn't he? Because he stuffs his into his back or something and channels Leptus or something. I don't fucking know. The lore of Rayman 3 has so much potential. Oh, fuck. Wait. <laughs> did he punch the kick rats? Yes, I did. Violent rain outside, you can't hear shit. Oh, fuck. That happens sometimes. <laughs> oh, fuck. That sound effect scared me. Why do I have a memory of the lava, like, rising up on the sides? Alright, uh, Reflux. Leptusi won't help you now. There we go. What's your favorite new Pokemon? Uh, I like Kyogre, Kyogre, however you pronounce it. Kyogre's Generation 3. Yeah, but it's it's new, all right. It's new. It came after Gen 1, right? <laughs> Rayman, you fought heroically in the arena, even though it kills me to have to say it. Reflux has never known the taste of defeat! <laughs> <laughs> Reflux is like infinite from uh, Sonic Forces. <sighs> Watch out for the frame, guys. The single frame. Or I don't know. I don't, it might be here. Well, let's, uh, let's pay attention. You spent too much money on Pokemon plushies today. Oh, hell yeah. What plushies did you get? The one Rayman 2 design frame. I guess next up is the snow world. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Hell yeah. Next is longest shortcut. Oh. You wish they explained the Leptus lore a bit more. It's so interesting. I wish they... Yeah, I wish they used the lore a bit more. More lore. Power of Tetris. Yeah, why did Globox say Power of Tetris earlier? 40%? Come on, I did better than that, right? Select, then hit the red button. Okay. Big burb. Wait, I don't understand. How do you do the... How do you do the freaking... Lore thing? <laughs> yes. I like the moaning sounds in the distance. Hold up. No. D-pad up. No. Does nothing. This moaning. This moaning isn't actually used in Gnosis Raymond because it's not part of the track itself. It's just like an extra layer of sound. It's a spooky sound. <laughs> Why is Andre doing that? Like <laughs> I don't remember how you do it on GameCube, but I think you either have to press D pad left or right or Z. Oh, I'm, I'm stuck! I'm getting bald! Holy fuck, I'm gonna die here. Could have ended badly. The Lava Matrix. Oh, the llama sound from Rayman 2. Here he goes inflating again. There he goes inflating again. I love how you can say that as if it's a normal thing Globox does. But it is. It really is. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, the teensies gave me full HP. No game over, guys. If you wouldn't mind, I would like to inflate right now. <laughs> you'll, you'll mind if I uh, inflate real quick. the fart sound.
Oh my god, here we go. Three of them. Actually, I think there's four, yeah. Why are my fists sometimes not hitting? I remember... Is this a GameCube thing or is this just me misremembering? Because I feel like the combat feels weird in this version. I remember being able to like pummel the enemies, just like boom, 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 boom. Oh, what the hell? Oops. You might not be close enough. They're not hitting because you're punching too soon. There's a secret zone and a green gem. How do you get it here? I don't actually uh, know. Or do you just jump from uh, the boxes? I'll jump over the fire. Ah! The hood stormers are like this. Sometimes you hit them, sometimes you don't. Oh, okay, so it's it's a thing. I guess my, I'm just remembering wrong then. Press the control pad on an enemy. I tried pressing... Oh! Oh, okay, here we go! That was... That was right. There we go. Oh, you can take... Oh my... Look at that! Globox is farting! Yo! I just took a picture of Globox, like, bursting a freaking, uh, plum fart. <laughs> I feel a little woozy. Are you doing this on purpose? What? Why are you guys uh, getting upset over? Save it and post it to Blue Sky? That's a good idea. Freaking Globox farting. Bro stopped right before the green gem. Oh, sorry, I was uh, thinking about whatever I was talking about then. You know what you did! Is this where I get my first game over? Is this how it ends? I'm gonna try it on the on the next enemy. Is there a secret in this area? Secret here? Okay. Let's see if I remember. Ah, here we go. Ouch! Ouch! There's a secret zone too. Is this the one you're talking about? I think it is. See, I got the combo. I got the combo. I kept it up. Oh, 
fuck, I fell. I did! I got the green gem and then I got the red gems! <laughs> you guys are freaky! You guys are freaking up the chat! <laughs> You get the green last! <laughs> Your combo ended before you grabbed the green gem. Oh, I hit the I hit the pole. I hit the pole. I wasn't fast enough. Oh Gromak son. A very tense rockery. I know how to drive out a negative energy. Or I should mess up the combos on purpose. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Let's see about that. Classic Ubisoft racism. Oh, no. Could you please hurry up? Group therapy? Groovy. I totally dig those. <laughs> wow. Ready? Romeo is the only funny doctor. Which one of these is Romeo? Also, I HATE THEM ALL! <laughs> oh no, no, I'm kidding. I just dislike them all. Purple haired one? Okay. No, don't let him get away! Dude, like the lava is so fast. If he finds the energy to multiply, all is lost. Exactly. Did, did he say he left the lobby? Oh, I love this cutscene! This is where the game starts! We wasted so long on fucking Globox War mission, this is where it starts. You didn't miss anything? No. This is uh, where the game begins. You might consider this stage one. <laughs> Reflux! I know that you dream of getting revenge against Rayman. And I need energy to multiply. <laughs> I like how Reflux is just there, like, drunk on the alleyway because he lost. Next level is long as shortcut and there's tons of secrets. Yeah, I, I do remember this. This is, even though it might seem like that, I assure you guys, this is not my first time playing Rayman 3. I swear on fucking Polokus' big fucking arm length dock. D d dick, I mean. <laughs> When was the last time you played Rayman 3? I think like five years ago. I was saving up so I can stream it. I usually play Rayman 1 multiple times per year. Rayman 2 at least once a year, but Rayman 3 gets the short end of the stick usually. Not that I dislike it or anything, it's just like. For some reason, Rayman 1 and 2 are so much easier to just pick up and play, in my my opinion. Now, where's this other toe of mine? Let's let's see if we can make it teleport to the start again. 
yeah, I think we can. No. -uh. Here we go. They're eating some pizza. Ooh, what toppings? Just pepperoni. Yeah, <laughs> no, that's good. I'm one who doesn't like extravagant toppings on my pizza. I usually just eat my pizza with like ketchup and mush and tuna and cheese. Simple person. You just finished your sausages. You had too much bread. Join the club. Finally. Bacon pizza, good. Ketchup, yuck. <laughs> the most toppings you get are pepperoni, ham, and bacon. I'm fine with pepperoni. I just don't add it to self-made pizza. But when I, like, get fast food pizza, then I'm fine with pepperoni. And what are they called? Prawns? Good, he picked up on it. I did, I did it. <laughs> See the button. I just had to scout my surroundings before I started, you know, showing my gamer skills. This is the most boring level, so you're gonna take a neb. A neb. Oh, a nap. Real <laughs> sleepy. Okay, hell yeah, dude. Take that neb nap. Gotta be fast. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's always when I eat like fast food, my throat gets like stuffy. You know, in, it's like full of phlegm and shit. I'm sure some people can relate. The hidden mirror. Where is it? Here at the bottom. Oh, now that you say it, I remember it. It's one of these, right? Bottom right one. The reflections. I remember now. They use the same platform trick. Hang on. There we go. Hell yeah. And I had the combat fatigue. Does that make you guys satisfied? Does that make you come? <laughs> 
Finally. <laughs> We were designed the entrance to the secret rooms in The Longest Shortcut is Evil. They are very good. I like them a lot. Oh, banana mama. And I still had the combat fat. This is just a freaking uh, arc from uh, Clonoa 2. I, I really like the design of this place. I just wish they would, like, explain what the fuck this place is. And what's with the windmills? <laughs> Thanks, dude. I appreciate it. It's the Netherlands? What? Huh? Good thing I know how to open the door now. Yeah, Robux, Razov music? Is this Razov music? Oh, this place is one of uh, Razov's mini games. I see. Your theory is that this place is the Teensy's Tempo, situated on a tropical island isolated from the rest of the world. Razov Shusak something. He has a big last name. Oh, Razov Koksak? I, I know, I know. Razov B. Alls Koksak. That's his real name. I failed at the last jump. <laughs> I am. All of me. That's more like it. moment I remember this was super cool as a kid You wish more games did similar things. Maybe there exists a puzzle game that does something like this. This feels like uh, something a puzzle game would do. Think you missed some secret? It that's fine. I'm not hunting for all the secrets. I'm just playing through the game. This music is putting me to sleep, help! Oh! <laughs> this reminds me of Dog's Life music, kinda. Yeah. 
You better visit Jesus Razor Beard in Hoodlum Headquarters. I wouldn't pass that opportunity for the life of me. Now this is the Spyro music. Oh. This really reminds me of that Waterworld from Spyro 2. They even use the same uh, sample, the ping one. Why is Rayman so bloody fucking slippery in this game? I want to I want to get to the least at you. That is true. That freaking instrument is also Spyro. Right? Right from here? Like into the wall? Or in here? Oh fuck, don't tell me I missed it. Oh my god, he said Cthulhu? Klobok said Cthulhu? This level has so many obtuse secrets that you never found as a kid. Oh, it's so pretty though. Okay, so it's the lead thing here. Like, before I go in there, I'm gonna take a drink, give you guys time to answer. Spoiler, Lee is still a while away. Oh, so Lee isn't even in this place. Brrr. Isn't Lee in the fucking, like, later level altogether? Next area, okay. This world is just not here yet. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 okay. okay, okay. Looks like another job for me. Once you reach a purple trampoline part, you gotta look out for it. Okay. Your belly hurts? Did you too eat the McDonald's? What is going on? Marka Donald's. Yeah. Oh, let's do this first. Charge up, punch <coughs> to see pretty lights. What the hell? What's up with those paintings of teensies carrying large keys? I think they're carrying nets, or am I misremembering? Which version is this? This is GameCube. There it is! Wait, what are you guys talking about? I know you're supposed to hit this. Oh, never mind. They're carrying nets, <clears throat> but also large keys. I think it's some of the very interesting lore stuff that never made it into the game, and it's only in the paintings. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my god, I feel like shitting. Oh my god. <laughs> there she is! Oh yes. She could have been in the game. Fun fact, that's actually Lee's actual corpse. She died after Rayman 2, and this is where the teens is like mummified her to preserve her forever.
You just remembered the Murphy face Lee. <laughs> you mean this one? Wait, do I still have it? Hang on. I gotta, I gotta look. I gotta look real quick. Or do you mean the scroll? No, this, this. Uh, Lee looking as good as ever. <laughs> Help. <laughs> yeah, the Scroogy edition was. Can't wait to do the Rayman 3 Scroogy edition at some point then. This was super hard to me as a kid for some reason. I remember this well. Well. Is this the place where the wall has been moved in Rayman 3 HD? The mysterious fucking moved mysterious wall. What? No, I was there! Oh man, the camera change tripped me up. It changed, so when I was pressing up, I like, you know, came out of the room. I tipped my toes into the secret. Well, not the secret, but you know. Okay, this time just wait here. The slippery, they don't use the slippery platforms in this game a lot. I just realized. And where's this guy? I hear the ee. Oh, this fucking noses Raven ambience right here. <sighs> Do you remember the hoodlum who shot himself in the hoodlum headquarters? <laughs> yeah. I got like stuck on the ledge. Lie, Lee, <laughs> lie. Lee died for Ubisoft. Totally cut on. Yeah, she did. Clutch, Clutch Gaming. That's my name. Lee reincarnated as Jade <laughs> or became a gamer. You thought my name was Gem Misser? <laughs> oh, you mean Gem Miser? Because. I'm Mr. Imposter. I'm Mr. Sauce. I'm Mr. Ventcrosser. I'm Mr. Among Us. Friends call me Gem Miser. Cause that's what I am. I play Rayman 3 and get all the gems and secrets. That's what I am. Check out the paintings. It's really cool. There's so much lore potential. Because the Keensies, Keensies, yeah, the <laughs> Keensies, Teensies, like even in Rayman 2, like, they had access to the Hall of Doors. They hold, like, the keys to the world. Shut up, Globox, I'm seriously gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm fucking, I've had enough of you, Globble. This is it. 
there needed to be more female characters in this game. They could have had Lee! And they could have just made more, I agree! But no, it's the French. It's the Ubisoft. So, genuinely, I remember we talked about this last time. With the, with the um, humor they chose for this game. Not sure if uh, I would have wanted to see what they would have done to Lee. Rayman is for Rayman! <laughs> Boating time. You mean Miss Razin? I miss a lot of game combos. Oh. <laughs> Hot topic, you honestly fucking hatelu. Well, I'm not gonna take that bait, but someone in chat... <laughs> I'm not gonna take that bait, but someone in chat might. This game has only one woman, and she's been portrayed like a masochist. <laughs> this music always just reminds me of the Balloon minigame. I fucking... SHUT UP GLOWBOX! Now let's get cannoning. What's the master strat? It's, it's, if I remember correctly, you just like run from cannon to cannon. I remember being stuck on this as a kid. Yeah, you just blast the cannons. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, let's uh, keep running like this and just blast every cannon. Oh fuck, they're ganging up on behind. We're getting booty blasted. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> I like how the map doesn't even show all the enemies. Is the yellow how much time I have left, or is that the HP of the boat? This reminds me of one of the some of the worst Jack and Daxter mini games. How do you know if you hit the fish glow box? Okay, good. Yellow was the enemies remaining. Whew, there's a Rayman Zero flag on the ship. Where? Hang on, is it at the mast? Oh, it's there! Holy fuck, I never noticed! <laughs> that's good, that's class! <laughs> Oh! Way past cool. Favorite level time. Is the boat a part of the longest shortcut or the beginning of the snow level? I don't know. Pfft. I don't know what the game considered, 
considers it as <laughs> We should take a look at the Ray map to know for sure Like what it's what the game thinks that it is You know what? There's so much conflicting info in chat right now. I'm actually gonna boot up Raymap right now and have a look. What it is officially. Here we go. Uh, hang on. Raymond 3. GameCube. Okay, here we go. The longest shortcut. Okay. The Summit Beyond the Clouds 1 is... The looming sea, so it's the boat. Let me just load in real quick. Okay, it's the first level of the snow world. The boat is the first area of the summit beyond the clouds. I just looked it up on Raymap. You refuse to believe this. <laughs> this is just Finland turning off. Oh my god. There we go. The O flag on the ship is a recycled texture from Rayman 2. I noticed. I don't think the flag is actually used in Rayman 2. I could be wrong. But I think it's one of the text. Oh no no, the glow box, the baby glow boxes swing them around. Yes. Yes. Um lazy devs? Recycling textures? <laughs> also on Rayman M, most likely. Oh, I'm, I'm flattened. Babe, it's 3 a.m. Time for your dick flattening. That's what Lee said to Rayman. Rayman also puts the flag on the parachip in Rayman 2. Oh really? Oh my god, I never noticed. The one you drive and save the baby glow boxes. That's cool. Okay, Lee. Uh, these guys have the butt crack! Holy fuck, guys! Guys, 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 guys! Oh, I couldn't! Wait. Oh, did you see it? Let me just show it, uh, show it here separately. That's the real butt crack of Rayman 3. <laughs> oh, Hoodmonger's music. Big boy booty. Fuck, here they come again. Oh. 
Why don't you also show the the gnome? If you have a picture of the gnome, sure I can. But that's the picture I happen to have at hand of the snow teensy with the ass. You actually had a pretty good nap nap. Welcome back to society. You missed the longest shortcut. Almost to a T. We just started the snow world. Was that sound the hood love? Did you hear that? Like ah! Me when I lose my body. Ah! Look it in Raymap. I don't wanna load it up. Blah, 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 blah. Load it up again. I'm gonna remind me at the end or at the end of the next stream because I don't think we're gonna finish this tonight. You hear that fucking screeching? Okay, it wasn't the hoodlum. You wish there wasn't a rice cream mode. We have the. We have the freaking. Um, Bika? Isn't that kind of a scream? Or do you mean like a ah! This is the place This is the place with the flying ball sack hoodlums They always feel like it's Christmas or December zone for the music it's very Christmassy, and I have a faint memory of playing this level as a kid during, like, Christmas. What am I supposed to shoot with this? Except uh, these. Hidden arena area in the trees. Sometimes the hoodlum here just kills itself. <laughs> what? There was supposed to be a hoodlum here? That's funny. Was it a boomer? Here. You enter the mine shaft. You enter the cork shaft. I always love how hoodlums can actually shoot each other. If you line them up, yeah, it's really cool. Makes the world feel alive. Ooh. Oh, the beginning area. Never mind. I'm already here. Reaching across these new frontiers. With my... Foot... In my hand. I listened to the freaking I'm Here remix yesterday. From the DLC. I didn't even know they had one, or then I just forgot. It's much better than the original, in my opinion. It's like the boss remix. Tiny, tiny man! Do 
Get it! Get it! Freaky Iceman! Oh look at the look at the bro running. Oh wait, let's try this. Okay. Never mind. Rem is about to get shot in the head. That's what it looked like. Uh, wah, 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 wah. That's that's the hoodlum. You can't fight the little boy who flies and drags them about. Rip gems. Uh, I'm gonna go back. Don't worry about it. This is just a secret area. Sip. Thank you. Let me drink that. Holy fuck, bro is like leaking. Let me take that drink. Mm hmm. Thanks, soundboard. I was supposed to mute for when I drink, and instead it starts playing fucking Terraria music. <laughs> Maybe Globox is having an affair with Aglet. Do we need to find Globox's memory tokens and help him unpack his regrets over his divorce with Aglet? Was that a Psychonauts joke? Or am I just, you know, I haven't played Psychonauts, but that sounds like something that would be in Psychonauts. Oh, that was Sonic Frontiers. My bad. My bad. The ass crack boy. back so Ugh. Ugh. oh <laughs> that's the biggest psychonauts fan here no it wasn't <laughs> i'll take your word for it do it two times and you gain in-game text i don't think i'm gonna do it <gasps> oh fuck this guy shoot i all Ah, uh, back to your old tricks now, are we, Mr. Comsock, Magic Man? Help. You like how in the ship, sun is still up in the sky, then where you land on the mountain is sunset, and the snowboard section is night. Yeah, it's really cool. Environmental story. Bro, you gotta be... You gotta be kidding me. Hmm. 
You meet this enemy at the very start of the game. How come you forgot he shoots? I always kill him before he manages to shoot. Is this a snowboarding sequence? Yeah, let's go! I don't understand why we gotta hit the bottom before Globox. Ouchie. Why is Globox in ice? Is he getting into Smash before Rayman? Oh no. It's Globox who breaks out of the battlefield ice spike, not Rayman. We had it all wrong, guys. <laughs> Is Globox rubber banded? I have no idea. I'm trying to get past him though. Oh yeah, you can like spin around for some reason, I remember that. Globox, slow down! Lobo Omen! Stop moving this instant! He beat me. Fair and square. The green gem? There's a green gem in the sliding pit? Okay, Globox, whatever you say. You used to play this so you could play it over and over again. You are failing on purpose. You gotta reach the, the bottom before me. Let me just focus on getting past Globox here. Oh, never mind. It's not happening. Did you know? This level is actually what inspired the creation of Rayman M. Really? Yep. Look it up. How can Globox talk even frozen? I think we won, unless Globox like zooms back all of a sudden. This level inspired the 1080 snowboarding for Nintendo 64 as well. True! <laughs> Kona stole the snowboarding from Rayman. <laughs> yeah! This song slaps, yeah. Yeah, we made it before Lobox.
Is this a new level? Yes, it's Hoodlum Headquarters time. Here we go. Hello people, welcome, welcome. Just in time, we're entering Hoodlum Headquarters. Andy's here someplace, I just know it! That little guy will start to grow on me. Shut the fuck up, Gobox! I'm gonna beat you to a pulp! <laughs> Good day. You are entering the headquarters of the Black Lumber. Exterior temperature minus 61 degrees. Interior temperature 98.6 degrees and rising. 98.6. I, I was just about to say they should do a 69 joke there. Can't see shit. Where am I going? <laughs> Christ, status. I hate Globox. Why does he even exist? <laughs> Sexy black him as a tram lady. Wasn't there something else I can shoot with this here? There we go. Oops. There it is. The hidden secret. I must enter that location. Oink. Oh, this guy's back. Yo, why are we playing this music? Not that I'm complaining, but... Never mind. Goodbye, music. You like how you can uh, use the rockets to find secrets? I agree. The hoodlum with the shield is called the Grim Keeper. The Gamer Keeper. What did I tell ya? Oh no. Wasn't there a face camera mode? Wait, what are you talking about? Like a secret game? Uh, secret mode in the game? First person mode? Oh, free. You said free cam, what the fuck am I talking about? There's this. We're gonna look around, but uh, I don't know if there's like a mode where you can just like detach the camera and fly around. There's the funny little photograph mode, that's about it. Oh, bro is back with the sexy music. Oh, I remember now. Nice. Nice. Sorry, what, what did you say? Something about uh, triggering, impatient, busting. B 
Busting, no busting. Okay, here's a here's a question to the to the slang masters in chat. Does busting mean busting, or does busting mean something else? I I I scared it away. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. The woman is named Toots. Where where is that revealed? I thought it doesn't have a name. <laughs> it's in Ray Wiki. Well, that does not make it right or like real. Only yesterday or like a few days ago, like. Ray Wiki. Okay, here's the thing. Ray Wiki claimed that the animated series was supposed to have 13 episodes, but it was actually supposed to have 26 episodes. And I got this uh, right in the iceberg, though for some reason I got it even wrong and said 24 episodes. <laughs> but yeah, Ray Wiki is not always right. It's 26, not 13. So like, don't take Ray Wiki as gospel. Toots is not a name. Toots is an old-fashioned thing to call a girl. Yeah, exactly. Oh yeah, Andre says toots. What's she named in the game files? I doubt she has a name in the game files. Just like, announce her voice or something like that. If even that. Could be something even more cryptic like... Grpts01, Grpts02, you know. As the, as the, uh, at the least, Thingamajig comes from an official trailer. Oh yeah, the Thingamajig. You know, I'm happy with the reception the Iceberg video has received, but I think the, the one thing that people point out the most is the Thingamajig thing. Because in the video, I accidentally claim that's his species name, even though what I meant was just, you know, it said that in the trailer, but... It's just a thing to call something that you don't know what it is, but it doesn't make it his actual species name. If I'm making any sense here. <laughs> name this later dot obj. Thingamajig is just a word for something you don't know the name of. Yeah, exactly, that's what I mean. Yeah, I I expressed myself wrong in the iceberg because that that's what I was uh, trying to s I was trying to say that even though it's just a word, some people call it by that. But yeah, it's in the it's in the fixes pinned comment corrections. <laughs> Rayman fans taking things too literal challenge. You mean Rayman fans don't take everything literally challenge impossible. That means no ultimate Raymond Iceberg 2. I never said that. Oh, we need another egg. Oh no, don't pick it back up, Rayman, what the hell, bro? Yeah. You want the Rayman game where he drives a motorcycle and we want to see that? <laughs> that would be cool. Rayman on a motorcycle, shadow style. Oh, yeah, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Why is Joker giggling in the background? It was the Hood Boomer. How about the Raymond Tree Creepypasta game where Rise of and Raymond join forces to stop the evil versions? What do you mean Creepypasta game? What do you mean Creepypasta game? Is that like a genre? Creep? Why does why does that have to be a Creepypasta game? Can't it just be a game where they join forces? <laughs> There we go, there you are. Raven and Shadow both both have incarnations where they cuss. I read that so wrong at first. That like that like weird Twitch chat formatting threw me for a loop there for a moment. We get to meet the lady. There she is. How close are you to the end? Uh, yeah, pff, what would I say? Like one more world after this? Two? I don't remember. There's the tower. Creepypasta games aren't made. They spawn at yard sales and flea markets. Globox, you're married! I'm sure he has divorced at this point. Oops. You remember as a kid you took like 10 zoomed in pictures of the cutout? <laughs> the fucking Globox! The pink Globox with breasts! That's amazing. He divorced. No, 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 no. His wife left. Big difference. True. True. Uglet left Glowbox. Not the other way around. Would you trust a guy who changed his name when he got the... Like, his first child was born? Uglet took the kids. She did. Whoa, what the hell was that screen shake? Oh, there's bros coming. Divorce makes you sad. It's a universe reboot. <laughs> Sorry, what's the context here? Oh, you mean like you don't want to you don't want to think that Oh my god! You don't want to think that Globox divorced. You like to think that it's a universe reboot. Same. This game, you know, if this game would smell like something, I think this game would smell like sweat. <laughs> bacon? No, th there's no bacon in this. All I'm smelling is like big fucking men. Like that hoodlum, and he's like, oh, 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 some, like, it's sweat. It would be sweat. You smell motor oil. Raymond, over here, quick, <laughs> the AI smell dispenser. Finally, we have real use for it. The hoodlums don't have skin. 
that is true, but at the same time, it just makes me think of sweat. Globox, shut the fuck up, 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 Here we go. Oh, that wasn't the cage. <laughs> Bro, in instantly going defense mode. This Globox is amazing! You're just a hater! We got it. Globox is not that bad. Nah, he isn't. Oh, I see the cage. <sighs> Globox Nation, get this motherfucker. That's an immensely scary thought. Globox Nation. I just imagined a bunch of fucking the meanest motherfuckers on earth. Just rolling over me. You never found him annoying. Well, that's fine, because it's completely subjective. I, on the other hand, find him annoying. I think there's a gem here. If Globox has one million haters, I'm one of them! If Globox has one hater, you're her. If Globox has no haters, you're no longer alive. Based! Fucking based! Mr. Electric, kill this man! Mr. Electric, send him to the penis box! The three options people have on Globox. Marry, fuck, or kill. Kill. I mean, out of all three of those, it would make me sad, but... I would kill him. <laughs> Did you hear those sounds? When they shoot the targets? If Rayman 2 Globox, marry. If Rayman 3 Globox, kill. That is a very good distinction to be being made here. I agree. Oh, Did you see the fucking vertex polygons on the shoulders there? If Origins claw box, kill. Immediately. No hesitation. <laughs> if Origins claw box arson. Into the Globber verse that I would watch that. That's the sound, guys. <laughs> I like <laughs> I like Automat there. <laughs> Amazing. I wasn't supposed to.
Oh no! Bro, shut the fuck up! You're you're breaking my concentration, Teensy! I'll save the world after this minigame! Here we go. Okay, now where's this dude? Okay, I see it. <laughs> Raymond, the world is burning. It would be cool if Raymond did the same, like, you know, dance, like in Raymond 2 when you save the teensies. Oh wait, there was the mushroom earlier! Oh, no! Oh! I forgot this mushroom. Oh my god! This is my favorite area in the entire game, guys. I used to love this as a kid and I still do. This is the epitome of, like, factory level platforming. This is my favorite area in the entire game. Sorry, what was that? Leptus is about to land on the tower? Did they just fucking call a Leptus? Like, hey. Wait. Did I hear that right? Have I have I never heard this before? Have I always missed this? What she, what did she say? Like Leptus is arriving? Like the Leptus? What? How about you show a fucking cutscene or something? The Leptus? That can't be right. I must have misunderstood. It's either uh, that or uh, Reflux is arriving with the helicopter. <laughs> I don't fucking know. But Leptus... That's so weird because Leptus doesn't appear. I always thought Leptus is like a creature of legend. Not something that actually exists. And now Leptus is apparently coming. What the hell? Or, like, exist as a god, but not in the Raymond realm or whatever. You know. I need some, uh, information. They're summoning a god, don't you remember? But they don't... But... Okay, so... Okay, okay, okay. So, she's not... She doesn't mean... That Leptus is arriving... Right now, while I'm still at the factory. She's talking about the events that are yet to happen in the final boss. Right? Because she made it sound like Leptus is on, on their way right now. And I thought there's some like weird shit going on where they don't show us Leptus or something. What do you mean it doesn't exist? I corrected myself. As in like a god. That's what I always thought. Not like a physical being that just swoops in and like fucks Andre on the peak or something. It's visible in the cutscene. What? She's wait, where does Lep Leptus does not appear in this game? The closest we get to is Reflux like I don't know, channeling his big dick energy and turning into a Lep Leptus like creature. Yeah, this is the Razor Beard room. I know where it is, don't worry about it. It's THE secret.
It or is pretty straightforward. Leptus exists as a spirit. Yeah, like something like that. But like Leptus itself does not like appear. You see its bird shadow, and then you see a weird sky that's presumably Leptus's body. When? In the final boss? If that's true, I've never seen that. And if that's true, I gotta pay close attention this time. In the cutscene. Okay, I will try to pay attention. Remind me once we get there. This is like the god believers think he'll arrive. <laughs> Both Reflux and Andre will look up and be like, oh, there he is. How the fuck I have like zero memory of this? What the hell? That, that makes things so much more interesting. I gotta pay attention to the cutscene when it happens. It's the Rayman 3 Amnesia. It really is. This game is so fucking confusing. <laughs> would have helped this would have helped a lot if this had like a I don't know a good story <laughs> This is one version of the music I told you about Oh <laughs> I see now when you told me about this, I thought you, <laughs> when you were humming it, I only heard the fucking uh, leg or razor's penis music, you know. It's kind of similar. <laughs> what the Bible? Just some Rayman 2 dudes. <laughs> what? <laughs> They show a lot less than you might expect. Yeah, I, I, I gotta see for myself, because this might be another instance of... ...fans... ...overlooking. I, I don't know how to explain it, but... Yeah, I, I gotta see this Leptus cutscene myself. That's what they sing at church, right? You think it's just implied that the big Leptus god gives him powers after he summons it with the stolen scepter, but you don't actually see the Leptus. It's so fucking weird. <laughs> Amen, brother. <laughs> Amen to them beans. Christianity moment. <laughs> I love that. Oh, look at this. The milking machine. They try to hide the Leptus as much as possible, and you never get a super clear look at it. But it's definitely physically there. Uh, okay, I, I, I'm not gonna say anything else regarding this. I just gotta see the cutscene for myself before I believe it. And actually, like, pay attention. You can see it's shadow. Yes, I will, I will pay attention once I get to the cutscene. But that's so fucking weird, because, like, Kid Me didn't even know the word Leptus, because, you know, 
One thing is that I was still learning English, but they barely talk about leptis in this game, and when they do, they go like, and like, kid me can't make out what they're saying. And then when I got older and I learned more English and I played this game, I still didn't fucking know what a leptis was. Barely even knew the word, <laughs> because they still talked... This game is just so fucking messed up with its, like, story presentation. And I don't hate it. Make no mistake, I don't hate this game. I just wish we had more and better. You have the perfect gameplay right there. Just give us the awesome story with the awesome lore and the awesome world. Subtitles would also help so much, that is true. Subtitles would- <laughs> my nose- Oh my god, bro is whacking me. Yeah, subtitles would help a lot. I know HD has them, but they barely work. Gumsy says, oh, Leptis, father of the Narren peop people. I know that now, but kid me didn't. And even even right now, Leptis is barely talked about in the game. And they don't make it out to be a big story-relevant thing. They just say Leptis here and there, and that's it. Subtitles are cool in general, but especially for whatever the fucked up shit was happening with audio mixing in PS2. Uh, look at that! I think this is a good spot to end on. Yeah, like I assumed, I wasn't able to beat this game tonight, but I will next time. Next time we only have a couple of levels left. And that leaves us good time to play the mini games too. The guy in Raymond 2 is a god too. Yeah, Pologus. Pologus is a god. Yeah, I thought we were finishing. God damn it. Sorry, sorry to like blue ball you. Keep edging. <laughs> okay, let's get this Rayman out of here. Rayman 3 will return. Looks like uh, we're doing a three-parter after all. Zoom.